So here are my Girl Scout cookies. These are the new ones, Adventurefuls. They are a brownie inspired cookie. Samoa is my favorite, though I prefer them frozen. Thin Mints, you know, everyone loves Thin Mints. Tagalongs, peanut butter. These are these lemon with these sayings I love. And this is toffee kind of cookie, which I am not sure. Toffee tastic that I try them. And here's my cute little C's candy. Hey guys, my favorite candy is C's candy. Now look how cute this tin is, right? I didn't get any at Christmas. Or did, I don't think I did. Um, Love it. My favorites are really Scotch Mallows. Anyone wants to send me something? Scotch Mallows. <laughs> they had a coffee one and I just would not, I thought it was gonna be all the time, but I guess they, a limited edition. Why are people doing that? So annoying. But anyway, I'll show you. So this is what's left. I did give about four pieces away to people. This one's really good. This is a raspberry one I like. Not so crazy about that one. This is good. It's a, a chocolate caramel, but really rich. Um, another one of these things. Got a heart. Not sure what that is. So let's try the heart. But I gave the other heart ones away. But I prefer dark. Um, but. Mm, it's one of the raspberry ones. I love chocolate and raspberry. So, yeah. But, oh my God, they're Scotch Mellows. If you guys haven't tried them. I've been eating healthy and really getting like between 10 and 12,000 steps a day. And I really haven't lost weight. I haven't put on weight. I'm almost done. I won't eat that one. I'll try to eat the chocolate. But, yeah. Okay. Girl Scout cookies. <clears throat> First, I'd like to say thank you to my sponsor of this video. It is Art Girl, Art Girl Bevo Creations. So, thank you very much. She's, she sponsors me in a lot of stuff. Um, but she loves to buy these things um, and shares them and buys them, you know, to give to um, soldiers and stuff. So, and then I'm going to probably take them to work. I don't know. I might do a few baggies for people, like my friends, you know, to try. Oh, that's what I'll do. I'll send some out. Anyway, this is the Toffee Tastic. I don't remember if I had this last year, which is not good. Rich buttery cookies with sweet, crunchy toffee bits. Gluten-free. So cute. I forget if they're $4, almost $5 a thing now. Um, palm oil. I don't know. Two cookies is uh, 140 calories. So let's see. I mean, they're good. I know they're gluten-free, so I don't know. It's rice, flour, starch, sugar, butter. I mean, they're good. For gluten-free, mm, I'm gonna save, I got two boxes. I'm gonna save one for <clears throat> Bailey, because she's gluten-free. Oh, uh, but she can't have dairy. And there's butter in here, cream. Sorry. On a scale of one to five, I don't know. Samoa's being a five, frozen Samoa's. I'd give it 2.5, maybe 2.75. They're good. I probably, if I didn't eat it again, I'd be okay. So today, you'll later, you'll see me shrink wrapping. Oh, I guess I don't need to put the half-eaten cookie back. Yes, ma'am, I will be shrink wrapping. Okay. Thin mints, <clears throat> my mom's favorite, frozen. But I'm gonna tell you this, all these has a dupe. And not even the Dollar Tree had a dupe, but the all these dupe is really good. Um, palm oil. So I love this, girl, go-getter, innovator, risk taker, leader. Thin mints, crispy chocolatey cookies made with natural oil of peppermint. Yeah, I love me some mint. 
I don't like, well, I hate, I hate wintergreen kind of taste, but I love spearmint. But you know, they're kind of falling apart. Look at that, my scone in here. So what is that about? Does that mean they're old? I mean, I don't know what the, they're good to September. Never seek them out during the year, but I'm always glad to try them. Okay. I'm having a cup of coffee today. My stomach's been upset, um, but I'm home, so. I've been handling it okay. So the tagalong, Tagalongs, crispy cookies layered with peanut butter and covered with a chocolatey coating. Peanut butter is the first ingredient. Is that nice? Come like that. See what I mean? What's happening? They're all out of their place. That's weird to me. And I really haven't handled them too much. I brought them in the house and been sitting in a box, waiting. I love peanut butter and jelly. Y'all, and Trader Joe's has this um, peanut butter chocolate ice cream to die for. And probably will die from a heart attack. They're good. And they're fine. A 2.5. <clears throat> Thin mints, I'll give a 3 because they're nostalgic. Okay, where am I? I love these last year. More for the sayings than the taste. So these are the Lemon Ups naturally flavored. Mm -hmm. Crispy lemon cookies baked with inspiring messages to lift up your spirit. I could use some spirit lifting. Flour is the first ingredient. Not lemon, needless to say. <clears throat> Why is this cookie? And you know what's very odd? Okay. I was going to say part of the cookie's gone. So I just, I'm not sure about this. What the heck's happening? So you got this part. Oh, it flew over to the other side. I was going to say, my God, part of the cookie's gone. Anyway. I'm going to say... Let's see how it says the lemon in here. I don't see any lemon. Mm -mm. How can lemon not be an ingredient? Because it has artificial lemon taste. You know, but I love that kind of cookie. But I love the sayings. <clears throat> so cute on charcuterie. I am creative. I am gutsy. I am strong. I'm gonna put this on my Instagram. I am a risk taker. Not true. I am a leader. I am a go-getter. Got that can-do attitude. I'm an innovator. I am bold. And the rest to repeat. So, I don't know. I love the idea of that. Been watching all those lunchbox videos. How cute. Again, I might give them a two. I would give them a one, but I love the sayings. And I'll probably always buy them for these sayings. I just think they're that's so clever. Okay. So, this is the new one. I don't know if they have more than one new, but we decided on this one. Adventurefuls is the name of them. So, that's a crazy name for a cookie. Indulgent brownie inspired cookies with a caramel flavored cream and a hint of sea salt. Y'all, it's all about the sea salt. Um, sugar is the first ingredient. Okay. Two cookies are 120. I wonder which one's the most caloric. Um, so Thin Mints are two for 60. The Samoas are two for 150. 
the tagalongs i bet 140 140 and these are 140. so i guess you have to look at the size of the cookie too right <clears throat> it's more of a purple but i love it it's velvety so i've been trying on a different shirt every day see if i want them or not but it's gosh guys it's like 50 something so some of them are super heavy so today i'm just going to go through them and try them on and just see how they feel because i'd like to let people have them before you know spring <clears throat> again I don't think this was me. Out of order. Look at these kooky ones. There's just, what's happening? Five bucks? You want your cookies all in their slots. What's that about? Anyway, they're like that. <clears throat> Brownie. Okay, you know, I'm going to take a taste of mine. Get that lemon out. Mm. Okay. I don't see. Hint of sea salt. tastes like anything. I'm not getting sea salt. They're the least calories. I don't get brownie. I get sweet. And sugar's the first one. Mm, two? I don't think I'd buy them again. Hit or miss now for my favorite now i don't like coconut i mean let me rephrase that i don't mind like coconut flavor especially in a drink or you know like coconut milk and, and like sauces and stuff but i just don't like like coconut shrimp or i don't know cakes with coconut all over it i don't like raw coconut but these are crispy cookies with caramel coconut and dark chocolatey stripe but it's something about this combination Two for 150, sugar's the first ingredient. Lord knows, let's hope there's coconut in here. It's not like fake coconut. Yeah, there's just coconut. But you're not eating Girl Scout cookies, really, are you? To be healthy. Oh, they're all tucked in nice and neat. But I prefer them frozen, so these I'm keeping and they'll go in my freezer. I'm gonna pack everything else and then I already gave some to the food bank. <clears throat> and then, you know, I'll share them at work. But if they're seal packed, then I don't have to do it, like, all in one day. Y'all. And frozen. They're three. Frozen. They're four, nine. I mean, there's just nostalgic, obviously. Don't know what it is. Again, Aldi's has a dupe. I'm sure there's stuff at Dollar Tree. The Aldi's cookies are so good. I'm really starting to warm up to Aldi, y'all. I'm gonna compliment my Trader Joe's. <coughs> so, okay. Still, Samoas are my favorite. So disappointed in these new ones. And taste like anything. So there you are. So that's it. That is my C's candy. And I did get more C's and I ate it. So you can get scotch mellows all on their own. And I did buy the little one to share with people. And then, um, but I love this. Gosh, I love me a heart anything. I really do. So cute. I've been wearing um, on my mask at work. I have, you know, gazillion stickers from uh, Dollar Tree and other places. But I've been stapling them. I should take a picture. I thought maybe what I'd do is cut up a bunch of stickers and put it in that and then set it on my desk. I don't know. Okay, guys. So, thank you so much again. Thank you to my sponsor, Art Girl Bevo Creations. And um, I hope you like and subscribe. Make a comment. What's your favorite one? What's the one that you always get? Did you try the new one? What did you think? What's your least favorite? 
Um, maybe next year we'll just get one of everyone, <clears throat> but you kind of know you're not going to like them, right? So, yeah. Okay, guys, take care, and I appreciate you. Please comment and let me know where you're from. If you're new or not new and haven't commented, let me know. I love it. I've got someone from Boston now and Wichita, Kansas, and um, Canada, and all different places. It's, you know, Pennsylvania, New Jersey, North Carolina, Kentucky, Tennessee, Texas. My friend in Texas watching never makes comment. Thank you very much. That helps me grow my channel, y'all. I don't want to list names or anything, but what do you do? Okay, guys, I'm going to see you soon.